Well, hello folks, welcome to episode 9 of this Tennis Manager 2021 save. If you remember last time out, um, we got to the final of the biggest tournament that we've ever played in um, since Jay has been in this uh, in, in, the, in the Custard Academy. And uh, we were going to be going one better to an even bigger tournament where we'd be playing Andy Murray. Yes. But before we get into that, um, typically on this channel, a um, little bit of housekeeping to just to highlight, typically on this channel, whenever there is some sort of major change to the kind of the, uh, the equipment or infrastructure that I'm using to, to make content, it seems to fall on a tennis episode, normally the uh, TEM2 episodes, but this time it comes to the uh, tennis manager 2021 so i have upgraded my lighting hopefully you can see that uh, you can actually see my face a little bit better it's infinitely better than the uh, the two bedside lamps that i was using previously i've got some nice fairly cheap um uh, lights and if you're interested in knowing more about those uh, if you're hoping to do sort of something similar um i will i'm happy to sort of share the details with you but very very happy with them i mean i'm mostly i've only used them for kind of like a couple of seconds but they look really really good so back to the tennis folks back to the tennis yes so we got to the final in uh, in the last tournament uh, the monterey open i think it was and uh, all the way through to the final but didn't quite get the victory uh it doesn't matter because we got a lot of points from it it has pushed our man all the way up to 65th in the world he is looking really really good i do need to do some uh, a little bit more focus on on the attributes though he's certainly um playing well but needs a little bit more time out there to kind of um boost some of these uh, some of these attributes a little bit some mental attributes i'm not focusing on enough and i think we need to do some work work there but today we're into the Houston Championship and we won five grand, which is the biggest win we've ever, ever, ever got. But here the, the, the purse is even bigger. But what's really exciting is our first round opponents. Let's have a look. So here we go. This is the first round opponent for us. You can see down there. Uh, hopefully, you can, yeah, I'm, I'm on the other side. Uh, so we are playing Andy Murray who is 98th in the world. Annoyingly, you can't click these. Um, developers, if you're watching, it would be great to be able to click the players on here so we can actually see what their, uh, what their attributes are. It's a bit annoying that you can't do that. But we are sitting in this tournament, which is absolutely massive. Unfortunately, if we win through this, we do have to play a uh, sixth seed, uh, the sixth seed who would be 32nd in the world, which would be a big ask for us. But I am super excited about this. We're playing now um, some of the best in the world. Um, so what we're going to do is play this game against Andy Murray, because how could we not? And then uh, we'll come back and have a little bit of a review of how we got on in the tournament if we got uh, a step further than that. Let's go and play uh, Mr. Oh no, Sir Andy Murray, isn't it? So here we go. Here is the report. He's in good form. Um, he's not really played a lot on clay. He's a defensive baseliner, um, which is, I think is a fair enough. He's got a big, he's uh, potentially got a big serve and he's going to look to destabilize us potentially uh, if he sort of moves between his different styles of game plan. So he reckons, he reckons that we might be in better form. So high serve intensity, which we have got, and target his opponent's backhand. Do we really want to do that? I think we're going to keep as we're going. You can see here on clay, we are 50-50 on clay. Um, we've won, uh, played for um, one, two, lost two, I, I guess. Uh, so, yeah, break point save. We're not getting enough of those, but uh, it looks like we're doing pretty well. I'm, I'm excited about this. Oh, that's him. <laughs> What am I talking about? Uh, yeah, we we played a lot more than four on clay, haven't we? Um, possibly. <laughs> this is our second tournament on clay. We won the other one, so we I think we must have played more than four to get through to the final. I don't think we've lost a match on clay yet. Right, let's go and do it. Hopefully, with the settings as they were last time, this should be a nice seamless uh, match uh, that we can kind of watch through. So beware, he's a formidable op opponent. He's less enthusiastic about that. Maybe I should have said that. I'll pay tonight's restaurant bill if you win. That's in your hands. <laughs> That's such a 
So yeah, I, I guess that might work if we were if we had someone who hadn't just won five grand in the previous the previous week. Um, you know, I think he can. You know, if we don't pay his restaurant bill, he can probably deal with that. Let's get on and do it. I'm excited about this. Uh, it's actually one of the top top players in the world. Admittedly, he's a he's a fading giant now, but um, nah, through injury and, and whatnot. But he's still here and he's still in the game, and it's great to be able to play against him. It's great to be able to to push on so quickly in this game. I wonder. Uh, yeah, it, it has seemed a little bit straightforward. So um, yeah, I don't know whether. I can't remember if there's different uh, difficulty settings on the game, but as things stand, it's not been that hard to get success. Right, here we go, folks. Here we go. Um, I think we're just going to go into it, and then we'll change things around if we need to. He did say a talk about focusing on his backhand. I mean, Andy Murray's backhand, as far as I remember, um, I haven't, you know, he hasn't been around for that much uh, recently but it would used to be one you know pretty strong that sort of blasting double-handed backhand that he's got right let's go we have got a break of serve potentially against mr murray though he's he's going along with his his uh baseline shots but surely to, uh, not surely jade as well long rally here I guess is what Mr. Murray does, isn't it? Oh, he's gone long. Unfortunate. It's a great start. Another advantage. Nice return. Oh, not so good at the net there. And we have broken Andy Murray. Believe it or not. Love 40 against him now. That looked in. I mean, you'd think we, we're looking good in this first set. He's got to be pinching himself at this point. Going cross court. That's what we like to see. Making Andy Murray run. I think that's what you've got to do at his age. You've got to make him run. Oh, unlucky, mate. Unlucky. Well, I see. He got the serve back. He's come to the net. And that is in. And that's a great rally. And 4 1. Well, this first set has gone so easily. 5 1 up. And Andy Murray loses the first set 6-1. I mean, Jay Clark absolutely smashed him. So he needs to do more on his opponent, opponent's second serve and take control of the point. So let's have a little play around with the serve and maybe go a little more aggressive on the second serve return. Right, there we go. Second serve. Um, we going high risk. No, we are actually going high risk. We're going deep. I don't really want to do anything more than that. That that seems like I, what I what I want to do. You certainly don't want to go short. No, we, we're going to we're going to stick with that. I don't I don't agree. I don't agree with that. I don't think we can do any more in terms of aggressiveness for the second serve. We could maybe move where we're standing, perhaps, but I don't think there's a need to do that. Let's get into the second set and we'll we'll adapt if necessary. Well. We've already got a, there's a break of serve there. Andy Murray nicely uh, winning that first game. Oh, it wasn't a break of serve. That was, that was I don't know what was going on there. This is the break chance for Murray to go. No, this is a second. Oh, my God. This is for a second break of serve. What the heck's going on? It's gone long there. Took me a while to figure out what was going on there. But yeah, we are two love down and um, love 40. So uh, yeah, he's he's woken up. A bit embarrassed with that, uh, that loss. He's gone long. Come on, man. Needs to be better than this. We have got a break back opportunity. Some silly mistakes. I wonder whether that's just kind of nerves. Oh, that's lovely, lovely volley there. That's another chance. I mean, if we can get the break back, that would be big. And then you can try. Well, we didn't. That's another break opportunity. And Murray knows how to take these, doesn't he? 
Sorry if you can hear my dog, he's eating. Oh, that was dreadful. And 5 1, 6 1 in the first set, we won. 6 1, we lost in the second set. Um, okay, so he's suggesting raise. That's the wrong thing clicked. Raise our intensity on key points. Okay, we'll do that. I wonder whether we just focus on his backhand, maybe. Target, that's what we want. Target opponent's back. That wasn't there before. I'm sure it wasn't. Uh, do we have that? Yeah, so we're going to close that. We'll, we'll see whether that makes a difference for us. Right then, folks. Well, big difference. A couple of small tweaks made. And Jay Clark straight away races into a love 40 lead on the Murray serve. Well, I looked in. keep it long oh dear me got to it just about and murray is he's doing what he needs to do here and that's a great serve three points one on the trot but another advantage oh it looked like it might be going out and again well we won our our game but it's love 40 again he can't keep doing this his mistakes will happen keep keep him in trouble and there we go we have a break is there still a chance to get through this it is with three one up now and we are 15 oh we just didn't move with we're, we're, we're juiced now three one up another advantage another break point that's nicely done oh it's gone wide it's four one my god 1540 oh come on it's a chance here oh, for murray he's he needs this he needs this if he's going to get anything that's a lovely return oh he, he did really well there he did really well there and it's 4-2 oh, it's, oh, it's, he's got he's got the break back point oh come on no, he couldn't get that. 30 40. Come on, mate. Your knees just. To... Oh, no, it's juice. I mean, it's it's for all, not juice. And well, he's got a chance for the break here on the second serve. Murray, it's I don't really know which is to, how this is going to go. He's just not moving very well. I don't know why that is. It's we're going to watch this through. It is the um, tie break. It's six all. Who's going to get the early advantage? Into a little rally. Murray has been quite effective in the rallies, hasn't he? He's uh, he's gone one love up, so he gets he doesn't get a. It's not. A, oh come on, it's two love. That's the mini break. That's it. One two. So here's the Murray serve. It's second serve. It's just a little bit long. That's a nice effort all the way into the corner but he goes down the middle forces murray to oh that's a lovely return and uh shawnee uh jay does really well to get the break back another second serve oh that's a lovely return it's hard dealing with someone of this quality but he has now got a mini break up come on jay this is huge if he can get it and again it's four two consolidating that mini break and so it's a very very good second serve there and wow five two he just has to walk in from here oh he's gone wide with a fairly straightforward return and uh, quickly back to five four but if he can win both of these he is he is going to win the match and it's five all He's got the chance. He's at least got a, a shot at it. Wow. Six all. Beautiful serve from Murray when it mattered. He's gone wide though that time. God almighty. Stress. He has had a match point. I just don't know where this is going to go. You just feel Murray's going to pull something out. Oh, 
He's into the net. Oh, that's a lovely bit of play, and he has chance. He's serving for it here. Come on. He's done it. He's done it. It's 7 6. Absolutely amazing. And actually, I had my webcam on there. I forgot about that. I think I did at least. Um, and we managed to have a very, very smooth match. So he gets through that. Um, I think whatever happens, that was an awesome result to beat Andy Murray. So what we're going to do now is I'm basically just going to play through until uh, the end. And then I'll come back and talk through where we got to, how we finished up. Well, let's just uh, talk to uh, not much of a victory. Yeah, that was a real thriller. It's always like the sarcasm in there. It's just not good. Right, I'll move forward and I'll uh, I'll be playing a few more games uh, and then we'll come back when we've been knocked out and I'll let you know how we've gone. Looks like we're playing Courage next, which is a tough, tough ask. Right, so rather predictably, as you can see here, um, Jay is coming to the end of this match against the seeded player Boric, who is very very good player and he just could not deal with the power that this guy had as you can see he's made a good fist of it he's 6-2 he lost the first set 6-2 uh, and you know he was in it for quite some time but then he just kind of went away from him and then in this uh, this one he has uh, had it more difficult and uh, yeah as you can see this guy's got so much power and, and pace around the court uh, so uh, here we go it's an advantage this is the uh, the match point. Still a long way to go here for Jay Clark, as you can see. So loses 6-2, 6-1. It's not at all disappointing, I think. Uh, I think you're going to have to work really hard and find the right tactical tweaks to get through that sort of match. But you can see the difference there. Uh, Courage was way, way too good. So even with going out of that stage, though, he does end up with uh, almost £3,000. So it is well worth, <laughs> worth playing at this sort of level. So let's have a little look at the, mat the, the tournaments that we have got planned thereafter. And as you can see, we're not playing next week. Then we have this in the, the Franca Villa La Almera Open, which is a, an MTL 80 tournament. So... That should be one that we are going to be comfortably going through. I'm not quite sure why that is in there. Then we're going to be playing in the Munich Open, which is a, a 250. Um, uh, which is a, a 250 uh, event. And then after that, we have uh, the qualifying for the French Open in place. Um, I'm probably going to try... And we Do we have two-week break here? That seems quite a lot. Maybe we will. Maybe we will. Uh, I don't know if we'll actually need to qualify for this. Our, our ranking should be good enough, but maybe it's because when we applied, um, we will see. We'll see. Uh, if I've got a feeling, I'll, I'll put a tournament in here. I think I'm going to put a tournament in here, which is let's have a little look. What's available for week twenty? There we go. So. Well, the MTL Masters, I mean, this draw side of 56. We could be into that. Qualifying for these, I don't think, I'm not interested in qualifying for those. Uh, there's the MTL Pro event here against Helbron. That might be a, a nice nice one because we're not going to get very far in this but do we want to have a little go at playing in a masters event just before that i think we're going to give that a go let's do that let's do it i think that's it for today so we are knocked out of the houston open but we did beat andy murray in the progress so uh that's that's pretty good let me know what you thought of everything in the comments what do you think we are going to be doing in the uh, the tournaments coming up where we're playing against higher profile uh, teams are we going to need to put more effort into training and trying to improve our some of our attributes we've put a lot of effort into the some of the physical ones but maybe we need to focus a little bit on some of those mental attributes as well 
Anyway, folks, let me also know what you thought of the lighting. Has it been an improvement? Uh, have you were you able to notice anything? Um, hopefully, you have been able to notice something. And if you have enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button. Please subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.